Hey everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to Today I Feel Like. It is getting darker earlier and that means a lot of us have to walk home from work or from school. We have to get off the metro or the bus or just ride our bikes. Whatever, we, whatever it is we have to do, we have to do it in the dark a little bit earlier. And so today I'm going to show you the Brynite HL16 Noctua and I have two of these. This is a 500 lumen flashlight that can also be a headlamp. So let's jump into it, check it out, and then I'll tell you how you can win. All right, let's go ahead and jump right into this and take a quick look around the box and then open it up so that we can uh, get it out and then test it out. And we can see right here that this is the Brynite HL16 Noctua. It says it's gonna have a 90 degree adjustable headlamp and it's gonna have magnetic charging. And then let's, you know what, let's get this little band off of here so we can see it a little bit better. So um, there we go, take that off. And we can see it's gonna have uh, some magnetic charging on there. It says right here, Brynite HL16, same info, nothing on that side. On this side, we actually get a picture of how this is gonna look with the headband and the, uh, and the light itself. And then on the back here, there's a QR code where you can uh, find out more info. So. All right, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and take this out. We can see here that it's going to have a little instruction uh, sheet there. It says unscrew the tail and remove the insulation film before first use. That's because they do that so that the battery doesn't discharge in uh, in shipping. So yeah. All right, well right off the bat, we get to see the light. I love it when they give us a presentation of the main product right up front and don't make us go through all kinds of stuff to find it. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and do what they suggest, which is to unscrew this, uh, this back uh, tail here and then remove this little piece of paper so that uh, so that we can actually uh, power the light up so we can see right there we'll get that out and now we have the battery in here which is a little 650 milliamp hour battery I'm not even sure what kind of what battery this is it is yeah that's that writing is so small I can't even see it so all right let's go ahead and uh, put this back on and um, and we can take a look around this light right here, which looks pretty cool. So again, we can see there's a little bit of a, a branding with the model number right there. On this side, we're going to see a little bit of branding where it says Brynite and it has their website. But this is great because you get this uh, you get this clip right here, and this clip is actually removable. So if you want to remove this clip, you can. But you have this nice pocket clip that you can use to to use to put onto your pocket or belt or whatever else there. And then we can see the hinge here is going to allow us to uh, make that adjustment. And you can see it's going to be a 90 degree um, hinge, so that if you want to use this as a headlamp, you can. But also if you just want to have it pointing straight forward and use it as a little mini handheld flashlight, you can do that as well. So yeah. All right. Now right here, this is uh, this is going to be the power button right there so that you can power this thing on. And I think, oh yeah, there we go. Just have to push it and hold it and it turned right on there. And uh, and that's pretty bite. I believe this is where the modes are going to be too so that you can, uh, you can have the different modes going there. And that thing, yeah. I love that. That's kind of cool to have a nice uh, bright light all the way down to a little uh, something that's really just sort of dim and, and great if you're in a very, very dark environment and don't need something super bright or if you're just trying to preserve your battery life. So, all right. We also have in here a, uh, a user manual if we need be, if we need that. And we have a, uh, a value added card on there. This is going to uh, be your warranty stuff there. So. Um, yeah, this is going to tell us this is going to tell us about the functions of the light and It shows that we're going to have a output a high output of 520 lumens Medium is going to be 200 low is 60 lumens moon what they call that is uh, five lumens And then you have a strobe which is also going to be uh, 520 lumens, so they also give us the run times for 520 lumens we're gonna get uh, one hour and five minutes for medium 200, we're gonna get one hour and 40 minutes. For low, at 60 lumens, we'll get four hours and 50 minutes. And for moon, we'll get 80 hours. So yeah, all right, that's very, very cool. Okay, it says it's waterproof to uh, IP66 and it has a beam distance of 140 meters or uh, 153 yards. So very cool. And it only weighs uh, 1.8 ounces or 51 grams. So all right, let's see what else we get in here. 
um, it looks like we're going to get a couple of things in here. So we're also going to get a couple of these little gaskets that we can use to replace so that if we need to replace that, we can to help it maintain its, uh, its waterproof uh, miss. I don't know what you call that, but <laughs> it's water resistance. Um, we're also going to get a uh, charging cable. Now this is something that um, some people may not like about this, but this does have a proprietary charger. It's a magnetic charger. It snaps right in there just like that, as you can see. So it's very easy to put on and take off, but because this is a proprietary charger, um, if you lose it, you're not gonna be able to charge your light. You're gonna have to go and get uh, another charging cable. So. Um, whereas some of these lights that have like USB-C ports on there, it's really nice because USB-C is very, very universal, but um, the magnetic thing is really quite nice as well. So, all right. And then uh, next we have the headlamp here. I mean, the, the head strap here. So let's go ahead and we'll, um, we'll take that off. And oh, I can tell you right now, this, this material feels really fantastic. I like that. I felt some head, uh, some head strap material that I just was really uncomfortable. This feels really, really good. I like that a lot. All right, let's see, this This is gonna fit. Uh, it should just slide right in there. And let's see if we can get this going. Let's see if we can get this in there. It should slide right on in there. Now, mind you, I am doing this without a, <laughs> oh, you know what, this clip is on there. I might need, to, I, need, I might need to take this clip off, so. But let me go ahead and look. I wanna make sure I'm doing this right to get this on there. So, um, I think, to get the, uh, I think to get the head strap on, I think I might, yeah, it looks like I'm gonna need to remove that little belt clip in order to get it on. So, um, so I'll go ahead and do that. Um, I'm gonna do that off camera here, get this thing, uh, get this thing set up and into the head strap and then, uh, and then I'll show you what it looks like and then we'll go outside and, uh, and we'll test it out. All right, so I have it in the, into the head strap and it's ready to go. Now, one thing I will say is that when you put this in there, make sure that you have the light facing in the proper direction because remember, this has a 90 degree tilt and not a 180 degree tilt. So if you put this on in the other direction, the opposite direction, it's not going to, uh, it's not gonna wanna tilt forward where you're going to uh, have it pointing out. Instead, it'll tilt backwards like into your head. So just make sure that you have it placed in the correct direction when you do that. Now, one thing I've noticed for me is that the writing where it says HL Nocta, where it has the, uh, the model number is right in the middle of the two straps. So if you had it the other direction, instead, it would be here. So yeah, just make sure you have it uh, set up right. So, all right. Um, let's go ahead. I'm going to put this on my head right quick and there we go. Actually, I didn't even have to make an adjustment. It's just ready to go right there on my head. And so, yeah, I can, uh, I can push that and have it ready to go. And, uh, let's go outside and try this thing out now. All right. So I'm outside here and as we can see, it is a uh, pretty dark. As soon as I get out from underneath the street lights, it gets really, really dark here. Now I do have the light on, but it's not very bright. I have it on the low mode right there. If I push it, you can see there, it gets really, really bright there. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off for just a moment. And I'm gonna walk over to where it is very, very dark. And then we're gonna see what it looks like when we go from basically no light to this light. All right, so here we are and we can see that it is pretty dark. It's pretty much pitch black. There's just a few lights off in the distance. So let's turn this headlamp on and there we go we can actually see it right there and we can make the adjustment quick and easy so that we can actually see it as we're walking and i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and uh and make it a little bit dimmer that's the uh that is the medium mode right there that is the low mode right there if you can see that and then that is the high mode so we're talking about 520 lumens of light and we can look way off into the distance there you can see that this thing is gonna go way out there. And the nice thing about it is, is that when you're, um, when you're using this headlamp like this, any way you turn your head, you're gonna be able to see the light. So it's just very easy to actually see exactly where you wanna look because just as you scan around, you can actually see wherever it is that you're looking. It's just really, really nice like that. So yeah. This is, the, uh, this is the HL16, and I have to say, I like this light. I like it a lot. 
I like it because you can use it as a headlamp or you can take it off the head strap and use it just as a regular flashlight. And you have that angle so that you can make that adjustment and, uh, and have it at a 90 degree angle. And you can just have it again, just straight if you want to. So I really like this and I love the fact that you can just see wherever it is you're looking just by moving your head. Now, another great thing about having a headlamp is that it allows you to have your hands free. So if you have to say ride a bike home from work or a scooter, or you're just carrying bags and you wanna make sure that you actually have your hands free so that you can use them for whatever it is you wanna use them for, a headlamp is gonna be perfect because it's gonna allow you to still look wherever it is that, uh, have light wherever it is you're looking because wherever you turn your head is where that light's gonna go. But you're also gonna have your hands free to carry your backpack or your briefcase or your purse or have your hands on the handlebars of a bike or a scooter or whatever. So yeah, headlamps are really, really nice for that. Now another nice feature about this light is that right here, if you notice, there's a little green light. That little green light right there that is actually the uh, that's actually the power button and the mode button so that you can actually switch the, to the different levels of brightness. All right, everyone. So there we have it. That is it. That is a look at the Brynite HL16 Noctua. And this is a headlamp and flashlight. It's a flashlight that you can use as a headlamp. It comes with the strap so that you can actually have it on your head. And if you want to use it as a regular light, you just simply take it out of the head strap and you can use it as a regular flashlight because it has, well, that 90 degree angle that you can use. And it just makes it kind of perfect for both purposes. So now, as I mentioned, I do have one to give away and to be eligible to win, all you have to do is, well, have a US shipping address because I will only ship to the US and then like this video and leave me a comment in the comment section that says, I want to win. That's it. Leave me a comment section. Leave me a comment in the comment section that says, I want to win and I will pick a winner and that's it. So good luck to you. And um, I'm going to leave a link to this product down below in the video description so that you can check it out and get more information or buy one if you're interested. I'm also going to leave a link to my Amazon page, my social media contacts so you can reach out to me elsewhere. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. And I am Larry with Today I Feel Like. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.